Today we're going to talk about our organic compound which is methanamic acid. Methanamic acid is an antrinalic acid and non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drug. The structure of the drug comprises of three functional groups, first of all carboxylic acid, then amine, followed by the phenyl group. Methanamic acid It reacts by inhibiting the action of cyclooxygenase. And cyclooxygenase is a type of enzyme that synthesizes prostaglandin. Prostaglandin can cause fever, menstrual cramps by triggering the uterine muscle to contract, pain, and is a pro-inflammatory molecule. Since there is a reduce in prostaglandin synthesis by methanamic acid, this drug is able to work as antipyretic, relieve menstrual cramp and pain. Lastly, able to treat arthritis and other chronic inflammatory disease. Oh no, I think I'm having a fever now. So hot, my god, so cold. I think I need to eat my medicine. No, this is the time of month again. Uh -huh. So pain. I want to eat chocolate. So angry. We oh, should. I should eat my medicine. Medicine. <sighs> Feels so good right now. Good to go. There are a few side effects if methanamic acid is used in a long term basis. First, it will cause heart attack, stroke, and serious skin reaction. This drug may also raise your risk of having respiratory disorder gastrointestinal disorder like bleeding in stomach and small intestine also cause cardiovascular and cerebrovascular disease that will affect circulation of blood to the brain not only that it will affect female fertility by affecting embryo or fetal development moreover epilepsy which is a central nervous system disorder can cause loss of consciousness seizure and unusual behavior lastly kidney and liver impairment Oh! 